Alex Boyer, Wes Barker. We are half of Big Trick Energy. We are oh, the yeah. good looking half yeah. of Big Trick Energy. We're the uh, season two. Yeah, this would be you know, maybe like, season two. This yeah. is all you see. Yeah. <laughs> Every episode starts with one 45 second magic trick. Mm -hmm. It is one shot, one camera, no cuts. This one is shot entirely in reverse. <laughs> to it than it just being in reverse yeah there's nuance to it mm -hmm. and and all timing and it was so hard to do dude yeah so hard so hard so many little details that we had to take care of and yeah. it was really like real teamwork effort like everyone had a specific job and went great well the reason after a hundred takes but <laughs> it went great <laughs> that's the reason i got alex here instead of chris today because alex leads this whole cold chris. open uh, alex leads this whole cold <laughs> cold uh, whole cold open Wow. This whole cold. <laughs> Alex, lead this. Wow. Cold open. And that's this video took more takes than this river spot. <laughs> video, man. Oh my god. All right. All right. Let's so, watch it. It's so crazy. That's the cue. Alex backwards. <laughs> so good. So, this appearance is so fantastic. Oh, yeah. Uh, but how it works is we fell backwards into a right. foam pit. Yeah. That too. It's crazy how something so small can cover yeah. something so big, right? Yeah, exactly. And, and it's just it's just that. And then us falling off the platform. This is me hauling ass getting out of that foam pit. Running so fast. Getting out of that foam pit was not easy. Ooh. It's not easy. Parkour! Fast he was ducking under the camera. <laughs> and oh, I don't remember that. Oh, so that's the first one? Yeah, boom. So they 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 uh, speeding everything up here, but so I have a full card tower and I'm pretending to be amazed because I have to pretend like Alex just set this card tower up for me. Yeah. So I start by being like, <gasps> like he walks up to me, we fist bump. Yeah. Because Alex decided that a fist bump looks the same in reverse and yeah, forward, which is a little, great yeah, fucking that's idea. That's a little detail that we added. A you know, extra a little, detail. A little extra detail. <laughs> Only for you guys. Only for you guys. So Alex picks up this cloth and then I just knock down the cards. Such a great reveal, by the way. Such dude. a great reveal. Yeah. And I, now I, so I knock them down. I gotta pretend like I'm trying to make them. Yeah. And Eric, again, so surprised. Because oh, Alex just did something amazing. He hasn't, but right. you gotta be like, oh, wow. You're so right, dude. The, so right. This is cool. If you look closely, forward version, you can see one of the dice kind of impossibly gets sucked up. Really? Right? And that's just because it falls. When something falls, gravity only works one way. And same with the cloth on my cloth. Right. Um, it, at the very end, you kind of drop at the last, right. the last little bit. When you play it in reverse, it sort of jumps into your hand a tiny yes. bit. So many details, man. No, let's watch. So it. many details. Dice tower built. Knock it down. Oh, so, what, so good. what was the key to that one? I think it was to cover the dice a little bit with my hand. So they don't do the thing we're talking about. Exactly. Where they magically assemble. But, but the movement as well. You see like dice just floating like on each other and it's like it, it's it's not gonna sell the illusion, right? Yeah. So I had to make like a a false movement that it's not supposed to be there just to be like, oh okay. You know like to be okay. Yeah. It's like that's it, right? I, I think that was the most difficult one just to sell exactly how the dice will uh, fall or come up and stuff. It was well, hard, man. I remember Eric gave you a note at the end, mm -hmm. like at the end, you wanted to be like, you're pulling the glass up slowly. Right, right, so you're so right. When you walk in, you have to pick up this glass yeah. as it 
pick it up, and then you have to do like this. Yes, you're and then, so right. And it was so, such so a right. beautiful, really said, yeah, yeah. beautiful call on Eric's and, part. And to like, yeah, good job, Eric. And to also focus on it. When you remove the glass, it's there and it's done, you know, like a real magic trick. And I think this is what sell the illusion. Let, let's just back up real quick. For the appearance, okay, which is the, is the last thing that happens, but the first thing that happens, mm -hmm. we all fall backwards off this platform. Right. Now, I'm going to show you a bunch of footage of crew trying this because it's actually super scary. It is. So here's a bunch of behind the scenes <laughs> footage of the crew doing because it's so fun, but it's super scary. <laughs> And then I get up, I run, we go to the card tower. Yep. The card tower is the first thing, and it was the first thing because it was the most complicated to set up. Yeah. Because it's a card tower. Yeah. So we wanted to have that, if we were going to mess something up, mm -hmm. uh, why? Well, Actually, what the fuck? Why did that one go first? Now that I'm thinking. We have no idea. It's slow things like that. that we so that one should have gone at the like, end. Probably, but the thing with this particular cold open, there's two crazy things. First of all, it's the only cold open we have that there's more than one trick. If something happened in the first trick, or we, we've we done all the tricks perfectly, and at the end, I mess up something, mm -hmm. we have to do it again, and again, and again, and again. And that's so a th huge shout out to the Magic team, yeah. because our, our Magic producers oh, were yeah. setting all this up again. Oh, like, yeah. I, I see uh, Marcus, Eddie, Danny, Danny Garcia out there setting up a card tower again, yeah. right? Rico's oh, over there God, so resetting uh, you so know, Rubik's Cube yeah. again. So it was, uh, it was yeah, a huge shout out to them, dude. They deserve fucking so many credits, dude. We actually had one amazing take because yeah. uh, our DP, Jeremy Schneider, he's, he's riding on a, on a track here that he's on a rig. That's like yeah. literally on this cool, like little train track. I don't know what they're called. What the dolly train track, train track, <laughs> <laughs> movie magic train track. I guess camera dolly, camera dolly. And one, one of our scenes was Let so good. Let us know good. in the comment. Let us know in the comment. We have no idea. Uh, to make it really cinematic, each one of these little vignettes, each one of these mini tricks are all uh, shot through these window frames that are hanging. Right. It looks really cool in yeah, the warehouse. Yeah, it does. It does, yeah. And, uh, and it's just for cinematic beauty and to make sure they're each sort of play independently. It's just a neat thing to do. One of our best takes, mm -hmm. uh, the guy pulling our camera dude on the camera dolly, because uh, there's a guy that like literally glides the dude around, he hit it with his elbow and he shook the frame. And we couldn't use the take. Really? And it was like one of our really great takes. Oh, I didn't know about that. And dude. we couldn't do I did it. Did not know about that. Each time we do a cold open, we see the whole team working yeah. with us, for us. Same vision. Same, Same vision. Same vision. One day, only for that. And it's it's just amazing. And there's so many details. It's incredible. <laughs> this is the easiest one. You just have to. <laughs> yeah. Alex yeah, literally takes a solve Rubik's Cube and just yeah. mixes it up and looks like a professional. How easy was that trick, right? Like, oh my God. Could have done it with your feet. Yeah. <laughs> And you're no stranger to a DJ board, eh? No, exactly. Mix, mixing board. We were so happy, dude. So happy, dude. Oh, right before uh, Alex goes, like, when he... Well, as soon as he leaves my card tower, right? And I know that one felt pretty good. And he walks off. I'm out of the scene. So I'm sort of just following off frame. And I'm like, come on, Alex. Come on, Alex. And as soon as he gets uh, Eric, now it's me and Eric watching him oh, push yeah. me. Like, come on, Alex. Oh, yeah. There's and then Alex so is like... Pressure, so much pressure. So much pressure. He looks so fucking funny because he's walking like this. <laughs> and then he's like... And then he gets something. He picks up an object and pretends to be amazing. Oh, wait. So bizarre. It is bizarre, man. I am so glad. I have a lot of camera footage for you guys. I'm going to mm -hmm. dump. But we celebrate so hard at the end of these cold opens because one take, all this setup, all yeah. this money, all these people's time. We have... PAs and, and builders that have been on site all day yeah. long setting this up. This one, one 30 second, 40 second, 50 second shot. It, it, it blows our mind, man. It's and so amazing, man. Like, so oh. amazing. Like, literally speechless about it. You know, like, it's crazy because, like you said, there's a vision to it. And it's to see everyone just working together. It's so beautiful. Like, this is magic right there. Yeah. Literally. I was like, okay, first trick is the cards, right? Card castle, boom. I nailed that. And I'm walking backwards thinking, Man, I have to do the second one super great, and I'm just like stressing out and just like, hey, cool, everything's gonna be fine, you know? Like, uh, and I, I, I go to the die stacking, and so much pressure on this one again because the way you have to move with your mm -hmm. hand. And if I nail this one, now I do the Rubik's Cube, and I'm like, now it's done. 
You know, yeah. so the pressure went like this. It's super weird. Like, ugh. Uh, I'm going to show you guys some footage of Alex practicing walking backwards because it's hilarious. <laughs> oh, but, great. Well, when you walk up to a table with somebody, yeah. you walk up, you look at the table, and mm -hmm. you go up, and you, and you step there. Oh, you're so right. And, and Alex, because he's doing things in reverse, when he leaves, he can't look where he's going. He has to step backwards and leave his head where... Oh, so my they, God, you're so, so right. It's, I it's forgot about that. It's such a weird... It's so it is weird. many things to think about. I can't believe how well you did it for how Thanks, little, how Thanks, little you had time to practice. It's your brain is not meant to think in reverse. It is so oh hard to it, think about. Imagine me practicing and rehearsing in my hotel room, <laughs> just walking backwards everywhere, dude. Imagine like someone sees that, just like what the fuck this guy's doing? Like what the hell? <laughs> Well, I mean, I don't know how much you practice, and if you look like an idiot, it paid off. You no, know, we'd film it, we'd all run over to the monitor, we'd watch it, and we'd scrub backwards, oh and we're god. like, oh god. Because you're like, we nailed it! You get over there, you're like, oh, oh this yeah. is bad! Yeah, it is so weird. Everything backwards is really weird. Like, yeah. oh my god. It was all about the little details. This one was probably one of the hardest ones we did. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. I mean, you can even see the... The bunny in the background dancing, yes. or uh, us, after Alex makes us appear on the platform, mm -hmm. we're celebrating. You have to be sure when you're dancing, you're celebrating, the movement you're making, you gotta think more like a boomerang, right? right. You can't do anything crazy that's sort of one directional, right. or right, it right, makes right. no sense, right? So it's very, that's why you see it like doing like this, and someone yeah. like this, and Eric's just like nodding. That was a great call for you boys to do, by the way. Like, it, it looked super natural. Yeah, it looks fine. Super natural, you know? I kind of wish they'd left some stuff in, like you mm. walking. So when you're watching, you're like, right. this doesn't look right. Yeah. And you might have figured it out. Yeah. You might totally have been like, right. is this totally. in reverse? Yeah. Like, I think it's fun. And some people have told me that they did figure it out. Really? Like partway through, they're like, I think this is in That's reverse. That's awesome. And that is such a fun feeling. It is. So I, I, I would love to see, uh, be honest with me, mm. in the comments, let me know at what point watching it originally did you suspect it was in reverse? Or yeah. if you were just amazed in general. I would really love to know that. And the network said, as long as you guys keep liking this, oh yeah, then they're gonna keep sending me Smash them. that like button, baby. So we could get every Monday, you guys could get another oh, yeah. one of these cold opens. I'd love to go through them all because they are each so different. Oh my God, so different good. Different methods, yeah. they're all fucking incredible. Each one is my new favorite, I, it's, it's, it's hard to say. <laughs> Uh, so thanks, and go sub to Alex's channel if you can, everybody. He's got an awesome YouTube channel, and he puts up videos all the time. Sometimes he teaches magic, sometimes yep. he's just a super dope human being. Thanks, man. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, oh. I mean, definitely hope you're enjoying Big Trick Energy. It's uh, Thursdays on True TV, 10, 30, 9, 30 Central. We are half of the team, <laughs> half of the but team, like 90% yeah. of the looks, Yeah. 92% so. of the brains, 99% yeah. uh, so of the skills. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, dude. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you liked this video. Like it, share it with a friend, subscribe to this channel, and let's do another one soon, man. It's fun. Another one this is super fun. Hell yeah. Like, at first I thought it was because of the lens. I yeah. just have a huge head. You do just have a big head. What a great intro. <laughs> <laughs>